welcome to a really warm and sweat and muggy, sweaty and muggy day in the Mayenne. Dave's Star is in France. Uh, what have I heard? Uh, so I'm at home today. Uh, I'm uh, putting some stones in. Not um, that they're driveway stones like these. Um, they've got to be cemented in yet, but as you can probably see, I've done. I did one side last year. This side, it's a bit. I've got to straighten them a bit, as in like they're all. They come down in a decline anyway, and in the incline. Sorry, incline? No, decline. And uh, so that's where I am at the moment. But I tell you what, it's hot and sweaty, and I'm not in shorts because I got home last night at six o'clock or thereabouts. I thought, oh, I've got an hour. I can uh, get get most of the lawns done uh, in that hour. Most of them couldn't get the orchard done. But in that hour, I still had my shorts on and a t-shirt. Didn't have any any anti mozzie on. I was ravaged. Absolutely ravaged. Hence, I'm covered up today. <laughs> there are bites all over my arms, all over my legs. I've got one there on my bumps. How it got there, I don't know. But uh, interesting. So now it is 1700. That's 5 pm. Uh, so I've got to put my tools away. Gonna have a shower. I think the missus said we're going to a music music festival tonight. That could be interesting. <laughs> what a beautiful day. It's uh it's still what is it, half past six, quarter to seven in the evening? Uh this is uh Dave's diaries in France. Um just taking little one out um, it's Monday today don't know what the date is June 16th or something I don't know not looking at dates just too busy to look at dates uh, yesterday we went to um, the handy chien um, hand over your dog day and our, our group Val group. Um, all but two dogs went through. Una being one of them uh, because of her skin condition, and uh, another one due to behavioural issues. Um, but Una's brother went through, uh, but he's on medication for his skin. Um, so. It's just a matter of time whether he, he he passes the training. I think they've got six months training. December, I think it's yes, uh, six months training. But it was good. It was good. It was um, very emotional. Uh, they provided a buffet, which was top notch actually. And um, we had a tour of this, the uh, facility. I'd never had a tour, so they took me round. Really impressive. Really impressive. So, uh, and then we came back and sorted Una out. We've got her until we find uh, her new parents. Or, you know, whatever comes first, whether she goes into, back to Handy Shan, they, they search for a, well, they won't search, they've got a waiting list. So, yeah. Be sorry to see her go, but it, she doesn't fit in our, uh, in our plans at this time or else we would have kept her but she's still beautiful never nevertheless so what have I been doing today uh, I try to get as much done as I could today sorry about the glare of the Sun it's hot it's really hot uh, I, I need to get fit 
Um, so, so basically it's, it's home duties today. I've been getting rid of rubbish, uh, washing, cooking, cooking for, you know, food preparation for the week. And then I was going to work this afternoon. I tried working. I just leaked too much. So um, tomorrow I think I'm in our Durupa. I need to, uh, because of this good weather, I need to uh, waterproof the outside. If I can, you know, I've got to assess the wind though. Ooh, nah. Two less. Come on. Ali. Two less. You know better. Come on. So, um, yeah, I'll be at uh, do her up a hopefully, fingers crossed. And then I can uh, put this waterproofing treatment on the external rendering. We're af we'll have to paint it afterwards anyway. Hey, hey, Jules, you've just eaten. You shouldn't be hungry. Come on, Ali, Oliver. Yeah, it, she, she struggles with the heat. Um, I can understand that because it's bloody hot. It has been bloody hot today. Um, hardly any wind. So, um, yeah. Yesterday was just weeding and getting rid of brambles. Um, after we come back from um, Alonson. Yeah, I swear the handy shout. Una, two less. And um, so, yeah, <laughs> me and the missus had a row because she, she wasn't motivated. I was outside doing some stuff because it was warm again, caught the sun, and uh, I was nearly finished. And she says, Right, come on, let's do this now. And then it came to seven o'clock. I said, No, nope, we're not doing any more. And she said, oh, I've started, so I'll finish. I said, Yeah, well, I'll see you inside. Hence the uh, row started. <laughs> But she's like that sometimes. Come on, Ali. Una, Ali. So, yeah, <laughs> it was interesting. But uh, we're getting there slowly but surely. Uh, we're not rushing things now. We're just going to take our time on doing things uh, we've reassessed a few things we need to take our time we need to start living start enjoying life and we're not enjoying it at the moment because we're just too busy and we're wiped out in the evening what's this? Oh yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? Isn't it nice? <laughs> you brat. All right, okay. Is that nice? Another hot one today. Um, what time is it? What time is it? It's five to ten. On a Tuesday. Tuesdays are what? I can't see with these shades. Anyway, it's Tuesday. Um, we've got a 
another mole infestation going on. Um, just cleared that one. Um, my last two traps failed. Uh, I thought I'd found the tunnels of use, but obviously I didn't. The last trap was here. Didn't work. And the one before was just down there. But they're, they're really uh, having a go this year. Um, could just be one mole. But I found another another tunnel. So marked it there. Just there. So uh, let's see how that gets on. Um, got some uh, spraying to do. And I've got to uh, top up the hornet traps with uh, Brin beer and do some trimming back on here and some pulling. So uh, let's crack on. Morning all. Uh, today I'm going to attempt to waterproof this side of the house and then uh, after that I'll be painting. It's currently 25 degrees so uh, it's going to get up to 31 so now's my time to actually do this side of the house. I'll have to do the other side at a later date but uh, let's go. That was hard work in 26 degrees heat and I'm not getting any younger but uh, that side is done but I'm not going to do the other side until maybe tomorrow 
or Friday because it starts to cool down a bit and it's um, today it's going to get up to 31 32 and it's outside the operating range of this um, product um, but on this side it's the shade so it's not really affected us as much it won't get up to that temperature <clears throat> So after this dries, we should be good to uh, paint the outside, but that won't be for a while yet because we've got to do the inside. It's just to seal the building because there are some <coughs> some cracks on the front which are letting in a, a tiny bit of moisture. You can probably, you may not be able to see them, but there's a fissure crack there. It's all right, our neighbors just looked at me. Uh, and there's one going up the side here. Uh, it's, it's just letting in a tiny bit of mo moisture. So this product will seal that and then the masonry paint, weather shield type stuff afterwards should sort that. <clears throat> Failing that, it's a reskim. That's not gonna happen. Because that will cost. I, I wouldn't be able to do that because I'm knackered. So there we go, that's that done. Right, on to the next one. <clears throat>